Hey guys, it's Ray here with another Victaulic issue. Um, just showing you some of the problems you may run into sometimes when working on a Victaulic valve here. It's a deluge valve. And we can go and reset it. And at the back here, it's a diaphragm that fills with water. And it's kind of like on a piston, comes down and locks the seat into place. Well, the problem is, is the solenoid's holding here, it's just fine. I have it, the pressure off right now, because I got the valve open. But what's happened is sometimes the, the clapper gets caught up on the actual latch. And it won't reset. So, sometimes what we need to do is just give it them a little tiny help. Sometimes you need to just give a little bit of help there, like I was just saying. So now you can see we just pushed very carefully, okay, because we don't want to rip that diaphragm. And now you can see this, the clapper is flat. Now the nice thing about the diagonal valves is we can actually load this thing with the faceplate open. So let's do that now. First thing we need to do is close off this, the manual release. That will allow pressure to be built. Now we're going to open up the constant water line. And you'll see the latch come in as it goes full pressure. And lock down on that seat. Now it's locked down on the seat. We can actually load this valve full of water with the faceplate open if we wanted to but i'm not going to take any of those chances but if your valve won't seat for whatever reason and even though you have pressure on your on your constant water it's probably because it's latched off of the seat because of the latch okay just open it up take it off as well sometimes you got to take it open clean it a little bit on the gaskets and the seats and it will seal up, okay? So there's another tip from uh, Ray.